Amidst the dry grasses of the National Renewable Energy Laboratory's Flatirons campus in South Boulder sits a research facility you might not expect to find in Colorado. From the outside, it really doesn't look like anything special, but inside, you'll find the future of marine energy. We're at the Sea Wave Environment Lab, or SWELL. It's a scaled down model of the ocean. You heard right, NREL has brought the ocean to Colorado in the form of this large tank. This 45 feet long, 8 feet wide, and 4 feet deep tank creates waves. There's a big paddle, a flap, kind of moves back and forth like this and pushes the water down the length of the tank. Those waves help researchers test scaled down wave energy devices before they're tested in the real ocean. This is the reference model three design. Right now, the researchers are testing a device 175th the size of what it will be in the ocean if first successful here. It aims to harness um, waves as they move by and it'll move with the motion of the waves and convert that energy into electricity. At full scale, one of these devices would be able to generate enough electricity to power a small community. I mean, this technology can generate clean energy, no, no carbon emissions, um, and harness basically a huge amount of energy that's available in the ocean. An energy source that will never cease. Ocean waves, which could one day power the world with their clean energy after being tested on the plains of Colorado. Meteorologist Keely Chalmers, 9 News. Well, at full scale, the wave energy device that you just saw would be 100 feet long. It will take a while for it to get there, though. Researchers hope to have them in the ocean in the next 10 to 20 years.